I haven't vlogged in two weeks. That's probably the longest I've gone, like, really ever. So, <laughs> this feels really weird. Um, hey guys, welcome back to Vlogmas. I thought I was going to come back a few days earlier, but I got really sick, and so I've just been in bed being terribly sick out of my mind. I, like, yeah. I'm really sorry that I skipped the past two weeks of Vlogmas. I never miss Vlogmas or anything like that. Um, if you guys don't know, I'm not going to get into it, but we just had, like, some really hard times with my family and again I don't want to talk about it but <laughs> some of you guys do know because I posted like an Instagram story but um yeah I'm back in Texas um I just went with my family for like the past two weeks really and honestly like this is my first day like actually going out into the world and doing something normal so um yeah um just know that this is like a more difficult time for my family right now and just because I'm like woo on camera doesn't mean that everything's like perfect like I'm not like some crazy monster but YouTube is something that makes me very happy and something that I've missed so much the past two weeks like really really missed it so I just want to get back and at some point you know you just gotta do normal things again so anyways today is the 20th of December that is so crazy I think I missed like nine vlogmas days or something again I've never done that um but I think I'm gonna keep filming and posting like after Christmas a ton just because I feel like it. So yeah, sorry I've been gone. Sorry for like a vague explanation. But love you guys. Thank you for all the messages and stuff. You guys are like the sweetest people ever. Yeah. So today I'm getting my brows done. Coco's getting groomed. I'm getting, I'm hanging out with Sab. Getting coffee with my friend Emily. Who was like my first friend who's ever been on this channel actually. I was thinking about that. Actually, we started a channel before I even had my channel. So she's like an OG. Um... We like did a bunch of family vacations and stuff together too. She's like my best friend growing up. But yeah, um, I'm on so many meds right now and my stomach is killing me and I just want to feel better already. So we'll see if that actually happens. I'm gonna put this on the charger and wait for Sab to come and then we're gonna head off to Ulta. Ooh. Ooh. Okay. Getting in a truck of a real Texan. This isn't even a real truck. Ah, uh, wow. Being in the real world, it's exciting. I really miss this. I have to finish posting this Instagram because my new podcast with Erica, the episode for I Love You So Much, if you guys didn't know, which I don't know how you wouldn't know, I have a podcast. That's the best thing ever. Go listen to it. Listen, listen, take notes, listen again, and love it. I really know how to sell something. Guys, I just said my hair is a rat's nest. I haven't heard anyone say that since like 2003. But um, we're going into Ulta to the Benefit Brow Bar. Remember last time we went here and I was like, we're just yeah, going in. That These cars are literally gonna hit us. Yeah, this girl, she used to work for Refinery29 and, or no, Urban Decay, totally different. Anyway, she did the best job of my eyebrows ever and she was having a baby, so I'll probably never see her again. By the way, this jacket is from Revolve. We're going into Ulta. Let's get Starbucks after this, what do you think? That's fine, like that hurts. Perfect. Yeah, Sab doesn't feel good. Poor Sab. My brows look so much better. Thank God, this bag keeps falling off. Yeah, but it's like a clear lip gloss as well. Like, it's like a... You know what's so weird? I've never owned anything Morphe before. That's like the biggest thing on YouTube. This is why I'm fake. Okay, here is my favorite lip gloss. This stuff is so good. Also, I've never tried any of these. No, actually, I have their coconut oil body. I really don't need that though, do I? Probably. Is this like a glitter mask? That just seems like it'd be annoying, honestly, but it's cute. I picked up a few things from Ulta. I'll show you in the car. We're gonna stop at Starbucks. It feels so good out. I love it. I love this weather. So, I look so pale. Look at me. Oh I'm, I'm, I'm self tanning tonight. <laughs> it's me! A Dear Media production. Okay, well, as much as I'd love to listen to my voice, I'd rather die. So, okay, first thing I have. Um, nothing is focusing on this camera today. Clinique face wipes. Oh, the Clinique dramatically different hydrating jelly, like moisturizer. We'll check it out. And then I got the lip injection, instantly sexy lips from Too Faced. I'll show you guys this stuff. 
Sav, you don't wear makeup, but do you ever like put something on like that's like plumping and it like makes your and then makes lips, my lips tingle? And it's so satisfying. Yes. That's this. You told to make sure nothing's on you. Yeah, put it on. Sometimes it doesn't. Like right now, I can tell. You know when you can just tell it's not gonna make it tingle though. No. Mm. I just know like it's not tingling, but it's a great lip gloss. That's what I mean. Like I wasn't like. Apparently Morphe has a really good lip gloss. I don't think it's like pumping, but it's just a good gloss. I just like really glossy stuff and really hydrated skin and like brows brushed out. That's all I care about. Is, are yours tingling? I mean, it will. Like it, those will tingle with that. Yeah, they're starting to tingle. Yeah, see, I think it's just that it has something on underneath it. But no, like this is the best stuff ever. Also, so weird, but sample size products are typically better than the real product because they want you to buy the full size. Oh, now it's starting to tingle. I don't know if that's for sure true, I mean, but I'm pretty sure it's though, true. For yeah, like I advertisement. Know. I know, so I always just like to get... Oh, I know. I'm about to call my dad, and now I'm calling Tom. Let's not do that. Today's minis. episode... Ah! I had chicken minis the other day. Well, I didn't. Ooh. Well, we missed it by eight minutes, Sav. <laughs> Guys, this parking job, it was horrible to start off with, and it was even worse when I tried to fix it. Twilight just got voted worst movie of all time. Sav and I are pretty upset because Twilight, I'm not gonna lie, it love doesn't get the movies. love it deserves. It doesn't get the love it deserves. I grew up on Twilight. I'm oh, sorry. Um, <laughs> whatever. I grew up on Twilight. It's some of the best, my guilty pleasures, and everyone just gives it so much hatred. We'll resume this talk when people are staring at me. What do you say? We watched it on your birthday. Do you remember? Oh, yeah, we watched it on my 21st birthday. Literally. Wait, this way. Also, there's no drive through here. Horrible. Thank you. Uh, woo. Oh, wow. Wow, wow, wow. Mm, yep. Mm. <laughs> teamwork makes that teamwork. Teamwork makes the dream work. Okay, anyways, guys, back to Twilight. Like I was saying, first off, got a little bistro box. Then, got an ice dirty chai. I even have. I haven't even had Starbucks in like over a week. Guys, I told you, I've been literally in bed for like two weeks. A heat seater? Why does everyone in the world do that? Have you noticed that? What? People always say, when they mean to say seat heater, they say heat seater. My mom does that, my sister does that, everyone does that. Have you guys ever done that? Huh. Did you, did you notice that you did that? No. No, people do it all the time. Wait, there's this thing. It's in his car. Oh, it's broken. Yeah, it's broken. Okay. So anyways, comment down below what you guys think about Twilight. I'm not afraid to be a Twilight lover. It's I'm just not a fear of mine. Like, team I'm, Edward all the way. Oh, I'm also Team Edward. There's no point in Team Jacob. He never imprinted on her. It never would have worked. It never would have worked. Sav and I are big Miley Cyrus fans. This song. I listen to bangers for the whole album. Good. You needed to do that. It needed to happen. this wow the whole vlog is me talking in the car so jojo posted an instagram like jojo 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 like okay. my jojo jojo, jojo, jojo okay. yeah um look at this so it's like sound on oh wait long story short she's recording her entire old album like jojo yeah i had that on cd when i yeah, was like yeah me too it's my old. like too little too late is still hey. my outside favorite song like she's like oh. look at that you know what we need to listen to? Jojo? Yeah, but wait for it. There's a time where you always connect with this song. It's an annual thing, and I just want to celebrate it. You know? We, oh, no, no, no. We picked up Coco. This is her before and after. Before. She's mad. She's going to the groomer. Come on, girly, are you ready? <sighs> she looks really cute with this length, but it's just really messy. 
and she just she's gonna come out and she's gonna be shaved but she just has to be guys like there's no other way around it so it's okay oh she's shaking poor dog well i went to the wrong groomer so take two with dropping coco oh wait sorry sam i forgot you're staying in here take two with dropping coco off oh yes this is lisa yeah yeah Guys, if you haven't already, um, join the secret Facebook group that we have going on. We're talking all the time. Let's try to hit like a thousand members before the end of the year. I have it linked down below, but it is so freaking fun and I just post a lot more stuff there. Um, but we're having, sadly, this will go up too late, but let me show you. We're having a I Love You So Much listeners like podcast uh, coffee date tomorrow. So, if you guys were members of that Facebook group, you would know, but I post it on my Instagram too. But, you guys should join, it's really fun. Okay everyone, I realized, I also forgot to say this. Both of my parents have since moved. I think my parents have moved every single year since I moved out three years ago. Yeah. The thing is, so my dad has a house, I'm from McKinney. The sub Wait, did I forget the, where's my lip gloss? So I'm from McKinney, the greatest place on earth, which is a suburb of North Dallas. You know there's a McKinney Monopoly? That is just something that we would do. No, for sure. I saw I saw like some parents sending a picture of it and I was like, you're kidding. Like I'm not surprised. Wow. That's incredible. So anyways, my dad has a house here in the suburbs and a house in the city, which is where I'll be staying for like the next week. We don't really come here that often. My mom sold her house and now got this cute little condo because all she's ever wanted was like a small little house. So, that's really cute too, but it looks like the same. So anyway, I just needed to explain this because it's probably very confusing. So, yeah, so anyways, in case you guys are wondering, I still haven't registered for my spring classes. It's horrible. I need to do that. I just hate it. Like, registering for classes is the worst thing that you could ever possibly do. Like, to sit down, and this is the real kicker. Sav and I still haven't transferred. We're juniors in college. We still haven't transferred our AP scores from high school. So I'm just like, oh, I know I have this credit. I know I have this credit. So it's just confusing because it doesn't say it online, you know? But we're going to do that this winter break. We're going to sit down, and we're going to do it. The thing is, it was free in high school, and yeah. now it's going to cost us, like, $15. But, like, if you were our AP teachers in high school, you were not surprised that we haven't done this. Like, if Mr. Helms is watching this right now, he'd be like... At least they're in college, literally. At least we're still there. Before our AP guys, literally, for our AP, what was it, world quit test? Oh, yeah, he gave us the notes. He gave us notes and everyone was like so encouraging in us. He's like, what did he say? It was like, he said something about how we were never there. But, but we were fun. Faith of us. Yeah. Faith in us. We like, it was like our last period class of the day. Our attendance was not that great. I mean, we passed and everything. I actually had really good grades in high school. But I, I put in. Exam. I got a two, I think. But I, I think I, I got a three, and I it was, was shocking. It was the grace of God. Wasn't even into that then, but it was the grace of God. So, that's awesome. Oh, uploaded a new skincare routine, guys. Turns out that um, I've had this... Oh, be quiet. Turns out I've literally had this video pre-uploaded for so long, but I forgot that I never made it live. I just thought I made it live. Like, that's what I'm so confused about. So... New video went up today, ha ha ha. So I'm just gonna keep procrastinating and show you guys my book haul. Um, this is one of my favorite authors. She wrote Uninvited, which is one of the best books in the world. Steph, have you read Uninvited? No. You need to read it, it's the best book ever. It's, it's just, it's so good. Anyways, and that's coming from me. So it's really good, I promise, because it's not normally the kind of book I would like. It's not supposed to be this way. Look, I started reading it last night, and I'm on page 109. I'll probably finish it tonight. Very good. And then, this, the actual book of this is also one of my favorite books ever by Jensen Franklin, but it's like the Devo version of it. But it's really good, and I'm gonna like actually pay attention to that. And then, guys, okay, listen. I would be the last person in the world that you would, ex not that this is bad at all, I'm just like, any southern trend of like, Stuff like this is just typically not me. Basically, I spent two days in Texas and I bought a She Reads Truth Bible. But it's a really nice one and it's really cute. Just gonna take it out of here. Ooh! Okay, so if you guys haven't seen it, they're all over Instagram. And Dom has one and we used to make jokes like about stuff like No, actually we love it, but anyways, um, look at it. It's really pretty and cute and it's really big. Oh my, my other one was falling apart. Yeah, but it's a really nice one. In store, they're like $50, but I know on Amazon they're way cheaper. I don't know if this is... The Bible that I have is a message remix. Everyone always asks me that, but mine's like falling apart. 
and people always hate on my message translation people hate on everything so i'm like just shut up but me as i'm literally opening a bible just shut up um but there's all these devos in it and it's really cute so it's a very nice bible it's very big so i'll probably just keep it at home and do like morning studies with it wait what are these oh did they're they like oh they're probably just <gasps> oh gosh what is wrong with me my hair has like never looked worse than it does today also i'm not feeling too hot right now but what's new um hmm i am looking for a mario badassio spray i know i have one in here like i know that i have one in here Ooh. Well, first off, anyways, like I said before, my friend Emily is coming to get me. We've been friends since, um, I don't know if there's anything I would recommend to someone less than the Canon G7X. This camera is just so bad, like, so bad. Also, my skin has never looked worse. I feel horrible, but like, you know, when you've just been in bed and not in society for like far too long that you just have to like, at one point, go even if you're probably sick but i'm on a lot of meds and stuff like i'm not contagious by any means it was like definitely stress induced but oh so anyways my hair a complete mess looks awful um <laughs> i'm gonna spray it's just like embarrassing that i'm going in public like this <sighs> i really am like if you guys have seen my big fat greek wedding um i really am like the grandpa or whatever who thinks that Windex cures everything, but with Mario Badescu spray. I literally forget my phone every time I leave the room. It's not good. Made it to Spoons. Okay, we're at Spoons. I'm with Emily. A throwback. Um, I got tomato soup and a grilled cheese. Oh my God, the pickle looks amazing. Beautiful. Guys, like probably like six years ago now, Emily and I, your, your name and my phone is still Blair. No. No, I literally. Wait, <laughs> no. wait, your name and my phone is still Serena. No. Serena XO exactly. Yeah, so we we filmed literally right there, like a Gossip Girl, like look Halloween book. lookbook. Thing. Maybe it was just a lookbook, I don't think it was a Halloween thing. Why did we do that? But right there, but it was so cold and now it's freezing. No, but your contact on my phone is still, like I'll go to text you sometimes and I do Emily and then I'm like, wait, Blair, it's still Blair. Landon's is still Chuck. When he texts no. me, it's still Chuck. Yep, it's been going on. That was like, that started like seven years ago now. Yeah, it was a yeah, long was, time. It's been going on for a while. Okay, we're trying to, this girl has been jamming me and always asking me to come to the store, but I never am able to, but we're here. Oh wait, she gave me the address. Okay. Is that it? McKinney Christmas? No, it's just like everything is Christmas. I don't wait. It's on Kentucky. Guys, look at the tree drama. Seriously, what happened? Oh no. Oh, okay, this is our 15th coffee shop that we're trying to go to. Oh, great. Somewhere with normal times. They like kicked me out. Ah, <laughs> uh, thank you. We got some hot cocoa. We've been FaceTiming our old friends. Love them, angels. Okay, guys, we're still having some drama. I think we have to, oh my gosh, look at all the drama. Let's go. Okay, we're jaywalking literally in front of a cop right now. I gotta go. I love the thrill. It's like, yeah, the thrill, the thrill. Guys, there's so much drama. Wow. Sorry about the tree, guys. How did that happen? Do you like that? Yeah, yeah, just like that. This is actually really cute, though, guys. Look at this. Wow, it matches, like his outfit kind of matches yours. We coordinate. Yeah, you guys coordinated. Guys, there's even more drama now. Look at all the drama. I need to arrest you for lying. <laughs> yeah. I'm telling you the truth, Emily. I really am. Guys, what the heck? <sighs> okay, so, wow. Really hanging over my hair today, guys. Coco is ready from the groomers. Emily just dropped me off. We had a fun time. Now, Ugh. I get my sweatshirt. Oh. Uh. Every, hey, everybody. Alright, Dad. So I'm gonna go pick up Coco. She's gonna look probably crazy. She's gonna be bald, so everyone be prepared. Okay, Coco. Show them your haircut. Go over here. She looks so funny. Coco. It's not a very good shot, but. Hi, baby. Hi, hi, baby. Hi, baby. Hi. Oh my gosh. No, you dropped the ball. 
Coco. Coco. Short. No, I mean mom. But you're cute. Come here, Coco. It had to be hey, like baby. that. But look, mom, they didn't like her. The way they cut her mouth, like at the ends of it, it's too long, so she looks old. Coco, where are you? Oh. Yeah, like. Okay, I'm at my mom's house now, but I'm painting my nails. I'm using Essie Forever Yummy. Maddie is coming over. But I haven't painted my nails in so long, and you guys have been really commenting a ton about this. So I'm gonna do that. Okay, so it's like eight. Maddie's about to come over. I still have to edit this vlogmas and go back to my father's. Woo! So I'm making. Oh my gosh! That was really something. I'm making myself a coffee, which is just awesome. So this is the creamer I'm gonna drink. I only drink creamer on very rare occasions, such as the holiday time. Today is the holiday season, and I deserve it. I'm so sick, as you guys can tell. Also, I ordered my niece her Christmas gifts. I got her a costume, like an Ariel princess costume that she told me that she wanted. And you know the Olivia books? Hold on, actually, let me get my phone. She's three, she's literally the cutest person like to walk this earth. I've never seen a cuter child in my entire life. She's perfect, she's all over my Instagram story every time I'm home. But, okay, did any of you guys read the Olivia books when you were younger? Do you know what I'm talking about? Like, okay, look at these. These books, so I got her this one and then I got her costume. I think I actually got her a few of those books, but so freaking cute. Sure, we'll see if I like this. Okay guys, I am back at my dad's tonight. I was just at my mom's. I didn't really vlog much. Maddie came over. We all just like hung out and talked and stuff. We basically just hung out with my parents. But Coco is barking. That's so kind of her. Half of my vlogs are Coco trying to get on my bed. So I hope you guys enjoyed my first day back vlogging and two weeks. I really missed it. I feel like maybe this vlog was weird, but I'm just trying to get back in the swing of things. Anyways, I love you guys so much and I will see you guys tomorrow.